So we're looking now at question 1a part 2. So I've got the table at the top, which is um, the summary that we found on the previous video. And so we've got our, pick, whether it's apples that picked the first harvest or second harvest, and then whether they're sent to export, to market, or to the factory, or whether they're left on the tree and so not picked at all. So let's have a look at our question. It talks about what proportion of apples are going to be sent to the factory to be made into sauce. So I just want to take a slight detour for a moment. When we use this word proportion, that's another way of saying probability. Okay, probability and proportion mean the same thing um, for, for probability theory. And the other way word that they could use is they could ask for a percentage. Okay, so there's three words, all starting with P, that are asking you to do the same thing. The other thing to note is with our probability and proportion words, you can choose whether you write the answer as a percentage, as a decimal, or as a fraction. Okay, any of those three forms are perfectly acceptable, and it's entirely up to you which one you prefer. Okay, so that's just a little side note for you. Now let me just clear the page so we can go back to the actual question. So the question said, what proportion are going to be made into source? So what I want to do is I want to look at all the different combinations that might meet that criteria. Okay. So I'm going to look at these different combinations here and figure out which ones of them meet the criteria of going to the factory. So the very first combination there, it's apples being picked and then sent for export. So that does not meet the criteria. The next one, PM, being picked and going to the market, that doesn't meet my criteria of going to the factory. The next one, PF, picked and then going to the factory, that does meet the criteria, so I'm interested in that particular value. Let's look at the next one, see if we've got any more. NPE, so not picked the first harvest, picked the second harvest and sent to export, that does not um, refer to the factory. The next one, NPM, not picked, picked, sent to market. That's not talking about the factory either. The next one, NPF, not picked the first harvest, picked the second harvest, and then gone to the factory. So I, this is another one I am interested in because that meets the criteria of going to the factory. And last but not least, NN, not picked the first time and not picking the second harvest. So that doesn't meet the criteria of going to the factory. So we can now write down and say, well, I want to know what the probability of going to the factory is, um, of an apple being picked at random and going off to the factory. There's two possibilities. I've got my 0 0.42 and my 0 .00, or 0 0.063. When I'm combining those combinations together, I'm going to add them. I could either be, get it picked and go to the factory, or I could be picked in the second harvest and then go to the factory. So I could be, so the apple could be picked in the first harvest and then go into the factory, or notice how I put a plus down, and probability, or means plus. So or it could be not pick the first harvest, pick the second one and then go on to the factory. So that's going to be my 0 0.42 plus my 0 0.063 and that will give me a probability of 0 0.483. And there's our answer.